Yes lads, how's it going? Max here and today welcome back to an epic vlog. It's Tottenham against Chelsea in the semi-finals of the Emirates FA Cup. We're about to leave the house, we're about to go down to Wembley, about to catch the train. Kickoff is at quarter past five. Come on you smell! <laughs> I managed to get a plus one with Dad. Thank you to the Emirates FA Cup for allowing that and hooking me up with those tickets. Cannot wait. I'm hoping to meet loads of you at the game as well. Hopefully loads of Spurs fans. You never know, the old Chelsea fan. I'm confident for today, but it's at Wembley. We've been there. We spoke about this before. Who knows what can happen. I've got my... I mean, you've probably seen it before as well. I've got sent a wicked delivery today. Pot noodle backpack. That's going to be going round with me. It's going to be <laughs> treated to all of the action. And I get to go pitch side. So it's going to be an awesome experience. I cannot wait. I'm ready, hopefully you're ready, let's go. So as you guys will remember, me and my dad always used to at half time have a goodie bag full of sweets and just anything really, random things. I think there was even like, what was the random thing that was in it once? A <coughs> slipper or something? A, a slipper? Yeah, no. so, there was something that wasn't edible. Yeah, it was a bit of rubber glove. <laughs> oh my God. Anyway, in this bag today, it's full of loads of sweets and obviously because Easter's just gone, it's got loads of chocolate. So hopefully I'm in the mood to eat them at half time. He's going to search for a ticket. Train station is just over there. And um... <laughs> He's such a dickhead. But we're just going to jump on the train shortly now and then uh, it shouldn't be too long. Hopefully about a 20 minute journey. Sweet, just anything really important. Brand, I think there was even like, I think there was even one. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Wembley Park, when exiting. So there we have it, we have arrived at Wembley Stadium. The last time I was here, it didn't go too well for Spurs Chelsea. We were both here, me and Dad. We're back again. We mean business this time. So Dad, what was the last game? you were at Wembley for? I don't know, I don't remember where I was yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He hasn't got a Scooby. He doesn't know what's going on. Oh, I'm absolutely buzzing for this. I'm nervous at the same time though. Like, hey, don't drop that camera. I'm not. If we score, it might break and then there won't be a vlog. So we'll see, we'll see. So people have been asking me for score predictions and I haven't given any away because I don't want to jinx anything. What about you, Dad? You going for a cheeky score prediction? Yeah, 5-2 Spurs, 5-2. <laughs> you was going to place a pound on that. So if that comes back, someone needs to give him all the odds, 325 to one, 325 quid. <laughs> There's always one. If you're wondering why it's also not that packed around me yet, it's because it's two hours before kickoff. I just have to be a bit earlier to obviously grab my tickets and um, sort a few other bits out. <laughs> As you can see to my left hand side I've got Osnos back again. This time Spurs against Chelsea were obviously rivals as soon as it's kickoff. We're not friends. We're not friends. Uh, have you got a prediction for today's game Osnos? I'm a bit nervous but I'll say 2-1 Chelsea. I haven't said a prediction and it's going to stay that way. So. Uh, 5-2, Dad, it's not happening. 5-2, I'd love that to happen, but I just don't see it. So we've just walked in Club Wembley entrance, we picked up our tickets, we've got my FA passes, and we're just awaiting the coach's arrival now. I'm super excited. I'm sure a few other bits out. Back again. Spurs against Chelsea, doing as it's kickoff. Friend. Uh, I've just casually had all of them walk past me. Harry Kane, Deli Ali, to name a few. Overwhelming. Overwhelming to be. Is, I can't even speak. <laughs> Oz, have you saying you were fanboying a bit? No, I'm man, sure. I love Deli Ali as an England, as an England watcher. <laughs> that was just mental. I just want to see Pochettino now. Dad, what was your thoughts when you saw the players walk past? I don't, I don't know, I was lost. <laughs> 
Lost for words. Lost for words. seats now so we're about to head back down the tunnel kick off very shortly <sighs> the nerves are kicking in so people have had to take off their shirts because we're sitting in club Wembley um, because people are sitting together a part of our ticket <laughs> so didn't see that coming so I can't wear my Spurs shirt unfortunately doesn't mean I won't be celebrating if there's a goal finally on the way to our seats I'm nervous are you nervous very nice. <laughs> I'm buzzing. We're nearly there, nearly a kickoff. Come on, you Spurs. Come on, you Spurs. Come on. Come on. Chelsea got three kick in a dangerous position. Looks like David Luiz could step up. Half an hour to make that decision. Absolute joke. 
I mean, I don't know, it looked like it, looked like it was at head. Yeah, well, yeah. He took about half an hour. Well, I, didn't think, <laughs> I didn't think he'd given us. I started hey! popping up now with the Chelsea fans. They've been quiet all okay? game. William stepping up. You'll be able to tell from his reaction. Chelsea. I'd probably say it's been one as even at half time. Chelsea don't really deserve to be ahead. Three set pieces for the goals. Penalty. What can you do? Not much. I've got the goodie bag here as well. It's chocolate. I don't really feel like eating it to be honest. I'm a bit annoyed with that half. Big second half needed for sure. Right, let's see the goodie bag today. We've got.
least I have got something to look forward to after the game. Got a FA lounge ideas, so I guess we're heading there after. Should be pretty cool. Right guys, so as you can see in the background, I am leaving Wembley. It's been a great evening. I've ended up going to a, the, the FA Bar Lounge. I've never even been there, so that was pretty cool. I had some free drinks. Ah, oh, the result, definitely not what I wanted to see, as you can tell from the previous clips. Come on, the Chels. Devastated. We're going to the final, boys. He is. How many beers you have? <laughs> <laughs> but it's what it is, final score 4-2, devastated to say the least. But maybe Spurs can concentrate on the league now. And I want your guys' opinions. Tell me down below in the comment section what you thought of the game. We played well, we deserved more from that. Tell me in Talk Tottenham, I will be uploading that very soon. Um, drop, smash a thumbs up on this video. It's been, I've enjoyed my day, it's been a good day. Met some great people. Just a shame about the result, literally. That is literally the only downfall about today. But we can concentrate on the league. Deli Alley scored a great goal. Harry Kane scored a great header. There's positive. We're still going up. We are still. Why is this guy laying on the floor? He's having a day off. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's it. He's having, he's having a day off. <laughs> so, like I said again, if you want to see more of these, smash that thumbs up button. That would be greatly appreciated. See you guys for future vlogs. Wembley in the background. Hopefully, you'll return soon. Take care. Have a day off. Bye bye.